<clears throat> All right, so here we are. Um, yeah, we just came out of the Witch in the Woods house. Um, she saved the pig after we gathered her some materials. Um, we're headed towards this compass. Um, let's see, do we have... Oh, I got all kinds of stuff. I'll look at that in a second. Um, let's go ahead and look at it now, actually. Uh, so for my axe, uh, I have another rune I can equip. Yeah, I got this after beating that last troll. Nice, it freezes people. Unlocks an additional follow-up attack by pressing R2 after the initial slam. Oh, that's if I upgrade it. I'm sorry. So, uh, Evaldi's Anvil. A devastating area of effect attack that freezes all enemies caught in the blast radius. It does, wow, a whole lot of frost. And if I upgrade it, it gives it one frost. Yeah, let's put that, ooh, fancy. It actually adds something to the axe. That's sick. Okay, so I can upgrade one of these. I'm not going to right now. Um, okay. Skills. Yeah, so I got all level 2 skills now. Ranged combat. Aim R2, charge the Leviathan Axe, cause an explosion on impact. That's pretty cool. After landing precision axe throw, uh, press triangle during the flash to recall the Leviathan Axe, cause the next throw. Or melee attack to explode on contact. Okay, that's a little much. Uh, while sprinting, press R1 to perform a leaping attack. That's a good one. Perform attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up the Leviathan Axe. While evading, hold L forward and press R1 to perform a quick axe attack. Um... I'm not a huge fan of any of these. All right, let's see what... Atreus will help Kratos when enemies are in certain vulnerable states or when Kratos is attacked. Okay. While Atreus is choking an enemy, he can perform a combo move if Kratos launches or hits the enemy. Nice. Or hits the enemy far away. Atreus can perform a variety of high stun damage attacks when enemies are near. Dang! Good shit. Uh, increase the talent's bow firing rate. Increase arrow damage and melee damage. It's pretty straightforward. Okay, so... Is... Let's go with the bow skill. And let's go with... The and melee damage. Yeah. Uh, increase arrow damage and melee damage. Let's go with firing rate as well. Not really. No, we don't need firing, right? How is he? He needs rest, but I think he's out of danger. Does he have a name? Hildas Feeney. He's been a good friend for a long time. I've never seen a boy like him. You said he was lost in the realm? The last in this realm. He's from somewhere else entirely. Back home, he could take any form he liked, but since he came here, he's been stuck. Stuck as a boar? Stuck in his mind. His own true nature grows faint in his memory, like a dream, while the illusion feels more real every passing day. I'm not sure I understand. To live, simply to live in your physical form, day after day, it's hard to resist believing you are your form. In youth, he might have had the strength to rebel, but Hildesvini is very, very old. Without me to remind him of home, of himself, I fear the boar is all that will remain. Well, I hope he finds his way home. Thank you, child. I do, too. Mm -hmm. Well, that's just some interesting backstory on the Hildesvini here. He's a changeling. Um... And I guess he exists in other realms. So that's pretty cool. Alright. Let's move on. Anyways, let's get out of here. See you later. Be safe.
Are there bad guys down here? There are. I see a boat. Yep, there's a boat right over there. Alright, what's up with these guys? Nightmares. Mom used to tell me stories about nightmares until, well, I started having nightmares. So I was embarrassed, but she said they were just another part of life and that sometimes there was beauty and horror. Uh, in the horror. She always saw the upside to everything, even these creepy little floating eye monsters. They're named after an, an old creature called a mare that sits on your chest while you sleep and feeds off your ear. Oh, there's dead bodies down here, too. There's a jogger over there. He, he gone. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on here. Um, Isn't that heavy? Yes. <laughs> Doesn't seem heavy. Yeah, because I'm pushing it. <laughs> Touch the water. Why? Do you know what is under the surface? No. It's a good spot. Then do not touch the water. That's a good device. Okay, I got another another mask. And back here is a tomb. <laughs> I think that's it for down here for now. Let's move on. I'm just destroying all this, which is stuff. Ooh, beautiful chest. Let's see what's in here. Talisman. Press I want to circle to activate to gain some health. Heck yeah. Thank you. That's this bottom slot down here. Finally, I got something for it. Very good. That'll work for me. over here. Alright, let's move on. Now we'll get to the mountain point. I just can't believe I'm here doing all of this. There was a time I thought I'd never leave our woods. Or even my own bed. You are not to blame for your sickness. Oh, I know. I guess I'm just saying. This is great. Is it great? I guess compared to being sick, however sick you were, we don't really know much about his sickness. Um, Alright, moving on, moving on, moving on.
Follow the compass marker to your next objective. Okay. Don't I have a map or anything? Oh, there it is. Okay, where does it say any sort of information? Okay, so this is the lady's house. Or the witch in the woods has the witch in the woods. Like, turtle man house. What's this? A shop? Okay. Neat. Alright. I don't really think I need to look at that right this second, but... There's a mountain! There it is. Close here. We flow into seawater. How do you know? Do you not smell it? If that smells the sea... The sea stinks. Huh. Look at that! It's Thor! Thor? Yes. God of Thunder. That's right! I never thought you'd listen when Mother spoke to the gods. I seldom did. Did she speak of one who could feel no pain? Oh. That sounds like Baldur. Baldur. An Aesir god. Son of Odin and Frigg. And Odin is king. That's right. Why do you ask? No reason. Okay. Well, that confirms it. Uh, son of Odin and Frigg. Whoever the hell Frigg is. Um. So, yeah. So, Mr. Doesn't Feel Anything is Boulder. Uh, okay. What is that? Is that a wall? Made out of... What are those? Don't answer that. Uh, let's see what this lighthouse is. I think that lighthouse is where I'm supposed to go. I think I see something. Just sitting there in the middle of the lake. Okay, it's a big glowing statue. I see rooms there. This chest. Can't quite make it out. It reads, sacrifice your arms to the center of the water. Awaken again the cradle of the world. What? Throw our weapons into the water? Guess that won't be a problem for you. Are you gonna do it? Sure was. Wait, there's a shipwreck way over there. See that? And there's a statue of Thor. Except I can see a lot more of him now. The water dropped. 
and the serpent rose. Oh, that must be why the beach wasn't there before, see? And there's the mountain. Look it, that building leads from the foot of the mountain to that golden temple. It was all just under the surface. Except for the statue. Good thing, huh? There's even a dock. There, next to the flag. Woo! That was pretty crazy. We're going yeah, to no. the dock first, right? That scene with the world serpent, we'll that is just to walk on it. Who knows uh, unbelievable. You know that serpent? He's one of the giants. He's so big, he's wrapped around the whole world and bites his own tail. An exaggeration. I don't know. Looks pretty big to me. Yeah, he's freaking huge. Alright, um... Uh, uh, where is it? World Serpent. World Serpent. World Serpent. Okay. We just woke up the World Serpent of Midgard. Father thought he was going to try to eat us, but Mother always said, Your Mungander was a friendly giant. <clears throat> he tried speaking to us, but I couldn't understand him. I wonder if that's the language all the giants speak. He doesn't seem very interested in us right now. I wish I could talk to him. I have so many questions. Where did he come from? What does he do all day? What does he eat? Maybe we can find out another way to talk to him. Okay. Yeah, let's find another way to talk to him sometime. Um, but yeah. Yeah, the world serpent's absolutely incredible. Um, so we're going to explore oh, around this lake. I was hoping we might explore a little. When we wish to continue our journey, we know to return here. Okay. Um. Okay. I think I can. I fast travel? No, I, I can't. Okay, so if I'm remembering correctly, this. Uh, is going to be a whole lot of exploration around this lake. That seems like that's all there is there. Doesn't seem like there's a way to get up. Let's go see. Okay, so that that's just gonna take me back to uh, the Witch of the Woods. Okay, so let's get out of here. Lake of Nine. Okay, so that's what this is. Okay, it looks like there's something glowing up there. What happened here? Shipwreck. Well, yeah. I wonder why it crashed. Do you wonder why it crashed? Can we land on it? There's a crow on it. Can I throw my axe at it? No, I can't from here. So I just kind of got to remember it's there. I saw uh, another crow earlier flying around. Found a new boat dock, okay. Yeah, the other one didn't have these cranks here, so I definitely couldn't raise the other one. These ones I can this one I can raise. Oh, let's see. Oh, that looks like explosive barrels. That's weird. Hey, that could be valuable. Abandoned ship. Let's see what that is. Exploring the Lake of Nine, we found that this beautiful figurehead, it may be all that's left of a ship that once went on great adventures. I wonder if there are more among these wrecks and beaches. Maybe Brock uh, would give us a lot of hacks over. Maybe he will. All right, well, now we can get the crow. Oh. Got him. Nice. Um, let's have him read this. I don't know these rooms. Oh, you can't read those? If okay. we find a cipher. I don't know what's up with this out. thing, but it doesn't look good. Here we go! Here we go. Okay. 
go. Uh, okay. It doesn't look like I stand a chance against these guys. They have skulls above their head. Okay, so I don't think I can let them hit me. Yeah, one hit, I'm dead. Okay. That was my first time dying. Yeah, so I'm not even going to bother with that. <laughs> We're not doing that shit. Uh, we'll come back to that another time. Alright, so I did get... Oh, you can go down here. Okay. So he can't read that. Okay, so the checkpoint was right there. Perfect. Oh, no, you can't go down here. Alright. We're leaving. We are not doing that. we got over here. Oh, there's another another crow. Oh, is that a white flag over there? Okay, let's go check that one out. Can we dock here? Torch is built with wood. That is a brazier. A brazier. Hmm. Looks like there's something written on it. Want me to read it? Sure. Kvekia. Okay, we got bad guys, but I'm going to read it. The So, Ignite. I was able to light this brazier by reading the runes. Some kind of spell, maybe. I bet there are more of these around the Lake of Nine. Were there more people here before this was a lake? Were, where did they go? So many questions. I wish we could ask the world servant. Oh, they blow up. Okay. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> and reckless. Take caution when lighting these braziers. Sailor and Hellwalkers will swarm to the flames like moths. I assume we have you to thank for freeing us from a watery grave. Us? Other spirits. The Lake of Nine is full of them. Most are able to move on from this realm. But we, lucky few, are stuck here in Midgard until our affairs are in order. Perhaps you can help them as well. We have no desire to help you, spirit. Ah, but you already have. I only wished to see the sky again. Farewell. All right, I got a common axe pommel. Nice. Okay, let's... Oh, sick. Oh man, that's like way better than what I got. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'll go help the other guys if, you, if, if, that, that, if that's the rewards oh, I'm getting. He disappeared. Come, let us not be distracted. 
Alright, I think that's everything. That's probably the world server making that noise, yeah. So, I guess we should keep an eye out for other spirits. What did I say about distractions? But it sounds like they needed help. They are spirits, boy. Dead things. They have no needs, only wants. It feels wrong to ignore them. We will get over these feelings. Mom <laughs> would have wanted to help them. What was that, boy? Nothing. I thought as much. <laughs> I don't think I could have got that crow from there, so. This looks like another spot already. Nice, okay. Just circle around this whole shit. Alright, let's go up first. Let's see if we can get that crow. Hey, it's another brazier. I suppose you wish to light it. Can I? Yeah, you can light it. Uh, let's see if I can get that crow from here. I highly doubt it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I can get it. Okay. Well, there's a chest in there, but it doesn't look like I can Boy. get that. Sir. Remember in God of War 3 that Thank we just you. played it, it had uh, areas covered in bramble too. Oh, that was what I expected. <laughs> These guys are really easy compared to the last guys. Oh shit, I wasn't checking that. Ow, you shit. Alright, we got him. Another spirit. Yes, another. It acts like a shadow, but you use his ice magic instead of Sierra magic. Definitely a Hellwalker. Okay. Spirit. Another spirit. Hello. Hello. I can't remember the last time I saw something <laughs> off these islands that wasn't dead or corrupted. What do you mean? The desolation child. Plagues this land, growing more severe with each passing winter. Do you know its cause? Not for certain, but I suspect the appearance of the World Serpent, along with the great flood that followed. Many were drowned, myself among them. The dead began to walk not long after. Do you need anything from us? Boy, I only <laughs> wish to speak to someone again. A wish you have just granted. Thank you. Corrupted remnant, a mystic remnant of a lost soul, used to upgrade the uh, warrior's handle. Nice. Oh, I can track it, so now they're on my map. Okay, that works. I gotta do a better job of uh, using my map, I guess. So it looks like there's some gold stones in the way here. Um, alright. Like fool's gold. I don't I can't do anything with that there. Um, what's that blue fire over there? Did I miss? Oh, that's the other torch. Okay, that I just lit. So there was a bottom area here. Let's not skip that. Nothing. Okay, just a dead end. <laughs> All right, Boy, let's what move on. did I tell you about offering help? <sighs> Don't. Correct. But can't we this just... is not a debate. You must learn focus. Our journey need be your only concern. But what if they can help us? I won't seem to know a little about the lake. 
And how does that help us with our goal? We won't know unless we ask. The world serpent's even over here. I told you he's big. Well, yeah, he's absolutely ginormous. Oh, it looks like I can get around over here. There's definitely bad guys crawling around over here. That was perfect. <laughs> he did it. Well? Well, what? The brazier? If you must. Um. Oh, crow. Those are nice and easy. Another apple. Sweet, I'll take it. I don't know what we're still doing here. Well, did you not see me just get that apple? Boy, over here. Yes, sir. Nice. <laughs> Ow. to see him get theirs. So you died after all the flooding? Indeed. I came to the Lake of Nine to pillage Tyr's temple, but I underestimated the severity of the desolation. Have you seen other men? Living? A bearded one with tattoos? Only the one standing in front of me. Thank you both for avenging my death. Useless. Okay. Well... We can't expect them all to know something useful. Yeah, Kratos is really interested in finding out more about Balder. Whoa, look at that. What's this about? Oh! Okay. Hey, it's a fragment of a language cipher. We should look for more like this. Okay. Okay. Uh, so the Realm of Fire ciphers, I need to find four of them. I just found one of them. I am um, apparently... Uh, Arturius can just stab it with in the mask with a knife and it unlocks the chest. So that's, that's the thing. Alright, that's definitely it for this area. Alright, let's move on. Maybe the next one will have more information. Keep your expectations low, boy. 
Spirits are rarely useful. How do they even exist? When you sever a man from his life, it is not always a clean cut. So you've met other spirits? Yes. Many? Many. What were they like? Annoying. <laughs> Serpent even knows part of his body's lying over here. Sure he does. I'm sure he does. I'm sure he knows where every part of his body is. Alright, yeah. See, these guys like a fight. Oh, that's good. Nice. We are done here. We are done. After we get all this awesome stuff. Well, worth a shot. Up, oh, I found a piece of the abandoned ship. And that's just the boat? Okay. And I can't read those torches yet, or whatever those things are. Braziers. Let's go down. Oh, crap. I need to recall my axe, I think. That's alright. I'll get it when, next time I land. Alright, so we're still just going left around around this place. Hmm. Man, there's a lot of these to land on. Another one of those holes. Alright, let's get this item so it counts as like a save. One more for the collection. Just an uh, abandoned ship again. Yep. Yeah. See what they look like. Not bad. Alright, so let's see if this is another impossible situation. Okay, okay these ones I can probably see. Ah, idiot. Okay. Father! Father! I totally froze up there. Alright. Alright, well, whatever. I don't feel like I need to do that right now, so I'll come back to it. I'm not going to sit here and attempt that over and over again all night. Alright, let's move on. Gates over there. Let's... We can beach over here. Oh. I'm just seeing if there's anything in this little cave area. Oh. I acquired gold. Okay. Hidden area discovered. Stone falls. Boy. The boat captain's key. With the boat captain in the belly of the Hydra, the key was mine. I traveled to a new land, but my ship wrecked and sunk along with my precious key. It lies just below the waves, perched in an underwater peak. Okay. Maybe a treasure map. It's a treasure map. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, there's a boat there. Our boat, I mean a bridge there. Dude, I can't. Oh my god. The heck is this guy? Yeah, that was hard. Man, I need to get a lot better at this game. I am struggling way too hard right now. Alright, let's see. Alright. Nice. Okay, so this I seems to be locked, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can get very far right now. Oh! Come and face me, God of Thunder! Thor? Your challenges mean nothing to the God's spirit. They do not listen. Do not mock my pursuit of vengeance. <laughs> well, my family devoted their lives to worshipping Thor, I've devoted mine to his downfall. And I will start with that statue looming over my father's grave. Unlikely. You are dead. Is there something we can do? For a reward, of course. If you bring down the statue, you have my blessing to loot my father's grave. He rests on an island to the east. Yeah, let's track that one. Why do you hate Thor so much? When my father passed, my mother built the statue to watch over his grave. Imagine our surprise when the God of Thunder himself came to offer condolences. At first we were thrilled, but he quickly took advantage of our hospitality. My mother begged him to leave, and Thor, in his drunken rage, killed her. I was left with nothing but grief. Eventually I lost that as well, and found only rage in its place. I... I'm so sorry. Come, boy. We have a statue to destroy. Yeah, let's go destroy a statue. You got it. My father's grave lies on an island to the east. Do not mistake my mother's statue of Thor with that monstrous eyesore to the south. Understood. Okay, so Okay, so now we're back here. So now I should be able to get those chests because I can go through that gate now. Oops, oops, oops. World Servant Scale Fragments, okay. Looks like something good. Rare Talisman. 
Activate immediately after being hit to recover faster. Also has a passive effect that increases the timing window on parries and greatly increases defense when blocking. As opposed to that. Sure. Yeah, let's put that on. I like that way better. Just press that one to activate. Activate immediately after being hit to recover faster. So I just get hit and just L1. Also uh, has a passive effect that increases the timing window of parries and greatly increases defense when blocking. Nice. That works for me. Alright, let's get out. I cannot rest while my mother's murderer stands above my father's grave. Alright, so we're gonna go over there. And do his quest first. The one whose mom was killed by Thor? And the then we'll, we'll go the through those gates. Reminder, oh, wait. The lives of men mean nothing to the gods. I know, Father. You know. But do you listen? Yes. <laughs> Never mind. This is where he wants me to go. Okay. Oh, Brock's here. Boy. Vathergar. Southern outposts of the Dwarven King. Dwarven King? Have you ever heard of a Dwarven King? I haven't. No. Nothing remains of Vathergar except the ruins of Mutzigner's cruelty. The once fertile soil is barren, soaked with the blood of both hunters and the hunted. It was the noble Dwarf King himself who demanded the bloodshed. He who conscripted the gentle farmers of these lands into an army of ill-equipped hunters, so whose thirst for savage beasts produced a legion of widows. The castle still stands for those foolish enough to scavenge, wherein dwells the deadliest of his quarry. Let caution guide you, yikes. Doesn't sound like a very nice place. Father will probably want to visit it anyway to look for useful resources. He's gotten a little predictable, but I'm still having fun seeing new places with him. Ah, that's nice, kid. Boy. Mm -hmm. Yo, whoa. Brock. What up, my dude? Um, you want to talk to me or? Oh. Hey, Brock. You ever hear of a dwarf king? I suppose you're talking about Motsignir? Motsignir. Some bitch ruled over the humans once lived in this area. Built itself a castle just north of here. A dwarven castle? What's it like? You got yourself a pair of eyes and legs, ain't you? Might want to stock up before you head that way, though. Old Motsignir's known for collecting all manner of killerin' creatures. Not sure who's looking after them now. Brock. Fuck else you need. <laughs> How come your brother's got half your brand? Because I ain't in a working relationship with that foot licker no more. I wasn't about to let him use it without me, and he likewise. Only thing to do was split the brand 50-50 down the middle. I guess that was the last thing we saw eye to eye on. What? You want a hug? Hit the <laughs> road. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Sorry. Say, uh, you didn't happen to run yourself a foul of a scruffy fella. About yay high, doesn't feel pain, sounds drunk, but probably just slow. <laughs> hey, how'd you think I feel about it? If I'd wanted a seer business, I'd have set up shop outside a brothel. Or a fighting pit. Nor fighting brothel. Uh, did he say Aesir? Like gods? No. <laughs> Be extra careful out there, you two. The roads are teeming with more than usual compliment of dead assholes lately. We've noticed. Any idea where they're coming from? Maybe they ran out of rooms in hell. Or could be Odin stirring up trouble again. Or maybe they all got lost. Why don't you ask one while he's chewing your face off? Uh, we'll just be careful. But so. Anything else you gotta say? You can just keep talking to this guy forever? Okay. So what'd you find out there? Oh my god, look at all this stuff. What's the enchantments? I can buy enchantments. An enchantment that increases my health. Uh, cooldowns by three. Runic by three. Luck. 
Well, why don't we buy one that? Um, cooldown seems good. Okay. I'm buying a lot of stuff here right now. Um, then I can sell, and then I can Best do other of luck stuff. with all the rampaging. Okay, let me go back to skills, please. So I have 3,000 XP right now, so I got so much XP. Alright, so I guess we'll do shield combat. Uh, double tap L1, yeah, we'll do that. Um, well, barehanded, all R1 to sweep enemies off their feet, we'll do that. Uh, well, barehanded, innovating, L2 to perform a quick attack, yeah, whatever, I don't care. Uh, press R1 after a last second block to counter the attack with a powerful shield strike. Yeah, let's do that one. Okay. All right. All right. That was awesome. I'm like way stronger now than I was a minute ago. Stronger and wolves. Arturus advanced combat. Arturus has gained confidence in combat and will now support Kratos by physically attacking enemies when he sees an opening. These abilities can be upgraded in the skill tab. Two ways I can do this here. All right. World servant scale the fragment. Very good. What happened to these people? Follow the clues. Okay. Well, scorch marks. They're all grouped together. So maybe they were hiding from some kind of fire breather. But they died anyway. Some sort of fire breather? What's breathing fire? I guess we'll find out. Boy. Yes, sir. Curse the Dwarf King. Bane of mankind. Sounds like he wasn't a very good king. I wonder why they hated him so much. They are dead now. Does it matter? No. Nah, I'm... Otter has escaped his binds yet again. Instead of flying off this time, he seeks revenge on his captors and is determined to turn Vethergard to ash. We seek shelter in the outlying caves where we found sanctuary in the past. Our king assures us his next chain will be unbreakable. If anyone can build an unbreakable chain, it's Matsagnir, uh, architect of the great stronghold of Kanunsgard, leader of a glorious new age in Vethergard. <laughs> all hail the dwarf team, protector of man. These people seem a little friendlier for all the good it did. Just them. curious. Curiosity is dangerous, boy. Stay focused. I agree. Curiosity is very dangerous. Wow. Oh, cool. Alright. How do you even begin to build statues this big? Dwarves are resourceful creatures. Annoying. 
but resourceful. Hidden area. I guess they must have been pretty important dwarves. Do you hear that? Yeah, yeah. Oh shit. Yeah, that was a dragon. These guys are really easy to stun. Nice! Perfect! <laughs> that was sick. Ah. Oh, that's the play right there. When the kid's holding them, I just freaking... Oh, I thought I was gonna block that. How'd I do? You still have much to learn. But you did good. Yeah, but I love that when you're choking him. Huh. There's a Thor statue on that island. That must be where the spirit's father is buried. Oh, there it is, yep. Oh, there's a chest right over there. Whoa, shit! Jesus, what did I just do to that thing? Holy fuck! You don't have anything to say about the dragon? This tatzel worm doesn't have the poisonous barb, but it does have a sac in its throat that lets it barf poison at us. I know it's really gross. The poison is deadly to the touch, so even if we dodge the attack, we still need to be careful not to step in it. The spit is highly poisonous, even on the ground. Throwing the axe with R2 will freeze them and keep them from burrowing is underground. That a dragon? I've never seen one so close. Well, no kidding. Over there. You've been very deprived. <laughs> <clears throat> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, another one. Okay. Boy. So much so lore. Cost of the hunt, six wolves, two men. Low do they call to me. Thirteen Draugr, nine men. Low do they call to me. Uh, three Tatzel Worms, six men. Low do they call to me. One Troll, one and forty men. Low do they call to me. One Dragon, nine and ninety men. Low do they call to me. Sounds like these people weren't very good at hunting. Maybe they should have stuck to the deer and the boar. Alright, we'll come back to that. Let's we'll see if we can get by this dragon. Uh, 
to it. I'm not really sure where to go. Up here. This dragon is dangerous. Oh shit. Whoa! Jesus! I won't let me pick this up right now, that's weird. This is actually pretty crazy. Um, okay, what do I need to do here to help this dragon out? Do I just leave? I obviously come back. So, I don't think that me leaving right now is... Alright, let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's just make sure I didn't, like, miss anything. Okay, I got a horn thing. Got full health. Okay, I got another one of these things. Okay, I gotta. It looks like I gotta take out some runes or something. Here, see what was up here. Oh, man. Okay, so there's this thing. So I kill him. Whew, they were just normal human reavers once, but they look like they've been corrupted by CLR magic. When did this start happening? CLR reavers are able to heal, so if we start attacking one, we should try to finish the job quickly. Three? There were three wounds on the pedestal. We've got to find the other two and free him. It does not concern us. I know, but it's what Mother would have wanted. And it just seems right. Guard your emotions, boy. Your enemies will not hesitate to use them against you. Yes, sir. So, there's one. That's for the chest. We'll deal with that later. Yeah, 
the other one looks like it's it looks like it's down there. Why you said it'd be dangerous to destroy the other ones? If it was your mother's wish. Yeah. You are too eager, boy. It may attack us, and we will be forced to kill it. Oh, good point. <laughs> okay, we'll see. see. <laughs> I'm becoming too much like Kratos. Oh. I guess this actually was a pretty big settlement. No longer. Yeah, these guys are easy. Oh shit. I can hit him. There we go. I'm really glad that hit him. Now what? Shadow, the only attack after they conjured an explosive shower on magic spell. We should brush them down before they can throw it. And try to dodge it. Okay. Okay, so this just brings me back here. Okay, so it's just a shortcut to get back. This area is huge, um, especially for a secret area, it's a hidden area, it said. I mean, this is totally optional, like, you don't even have to do any of the stuff I'm doing. Oh, let's see, let's go up here, yeah. Okay. Oh, shit! That scared the shit out of me. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay, so now I can get to this. Get over there. What's going on over here? Okay. Oh shit. I just gained all his life back. Ah, oh, come on, I couldn't get away from that. <laughs> oh crap, he didn't even die. Got 
gotcha. A tough fight. It was a very tough fight. Oh, there's a crow in there. Got him. Look here. Yes, sir. Hmm. This is good to know. I still, I think I should have been able to. Alright, let's read this lore and let's explore over here. The Gravedigger, while I throw dirt on the mangled citizens of Vethegard, Muskneer looks upon his newly caged beast with a gleeful fervor. I curse his name. The Dwarf King set the capture of trolls and dragons above the safety of his own followers. Same followers who served him, revered him, hunted these monsters, and died, forgotten. My attempt to free the beast failed. The Muskneer's punishment was swift. I am banned from Cummins Guard, demoted to town Gravedigger, a fitting end for a once proud hunter whose prey hastened the fall of Vethergard. Birth halt. Okay. There's a rune there. Ah, uh, there's the last piece. Okay, so maybe I gotta go through here. What do I gotta do? What do I gotta do? I'm not sure what I have to do here. So this is just a shortcut to get back over there. So TR. So this needs to be T, I bet. Or whatever. Arrow pointing up. R. F. And then I just turn this one. Yep. I didn't move the rest of them. Oh, you got some? Oh. I guess I didn't have the right letter. What did they say, boy? True. To believe or to have faith in. So they still had faith in their king? Even after he got so many of them killed? It is a command to have faith despite his failures. Oh, Jesus! Oh, shit! That sucked. I got exploded. Alright. Man, there's this is a crazy hidden area. There's Atreus so much to, to it. Okay, coming. Wow. Look at this place. A ruin. Oh, yeah. He must have been impressive back when he ruled. I can't believe how incredibly huge this area is. It looks, I think that this is where, yeah, this is it. Let's do this real quick. Oh, shit. Dudes. All right, last one. I guess now we find out if dragons can be grateful or not.
Alright, I'll come back here in a minute. Let's go. Ch let's go see if. Let's go see with if um, he loves us or hates us. Sir. Yep, your time to stabby stabby time. You need help? Please don't eat us. Please don't eat us. Boy, prepare yourself. Huh. You're welcome. Very nice. Rare enchantment. Sprinting for three seconds grants unstoppable aura, preventing interruptions by enemies' attacks. Whoa. Nice. Nice. Very cool. Liberate dragons from their bondage. Okay. I'm not sure how it works, but okay. Oh, OT Odor. Okay. Mom once told me about uh, Odor. He was a dwarf who could turn into an otter, which is how he got his name, I guess. Is this the same otter? How did he become a dragon? I'd ask father, but I don't. Th I don't think he cares. <laughs> it's when I have so many questions like this that's when I miss the mob boss. Oh, that's kind of sad. All right, so there's a chain up there. Okay. So I'm a little confused. I don't know if that's something I have to equip or that's just something that I just have now. I'll open that up after this. Oh. No, there's two in there. I think so. Nice. They're doing a lot of Dark Soulsy kind of stuff here where they just hide bad guys immediately around the corner. <laughs> stuff good stuff all right so I have I went right so now we're doing this oh, hold on okay now we're fine That was really effective. I was just kind of doing that. Uh, I didn't think it was going to be that effective. Alright, wow, we got almost all six horns. Nice. <laughs> Finally, some health. Man, there is so much lore here. Look here. Yes, sir. The Dwarf King made his subjects hunt dragons and other monsters for him? The hunt for death. We baited the beast with a stuck fawn. Her cries echoed on the morning breeze. It did not take long for death's hammer to approach. The smell of burnt grass, the bleeding of dying, the dying fawn, the fear of imminent death. Many could not hold their breakfast. When it stopped, 
stepped into the clearing, our attack was swift. The vanguard died instantly, burned to ash. No time to react. The hunt continues as we led the enraged troll to the Lake of Nine. There we subdued it, but not before losing 30 more men. Upon our return, King Mutsugnir proclaimed a week of celebration. The festivities were sparsely attended, though not for lack of pride in the victory, the population of Vethegard had just been reduced by a quarter. I fear this sad irony was lost on the dwarf. Some king, huh? Yeah. Nice. Oops, no, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, I guess I turned it off. Nice. Okay, I definitely hear. Sounds like a troll to me. Damn, I keep pressing the wrong button. see this. Looks like that lever over there will free him. He will attack. I know, but it feels wrong to keep something caged like this. Your emotions again, boy. Ignore them, and ready yourself. Okay. Oops. Should have saved that. <laughs> Nothing in here? Okay. That's the lever? Okay. This lever here, too? What's this one do? Oh, it's locked. Jesus Christ.
Man. I went into full concentration mode there. You fought well, Atreus. Yeah. Thank you, Father. That was good shit. Dude, holy crap. He had me down to like one hit before he was even at half health. <laughs> we found Dottie Hamar trapped in a cage in Vethergard. The Dwarf King had managed to capture him somehow. Why was he in the cage? We could have just let him rot down there, but even for a troll, that felt cruel. Unleashed powerful attack that inflicts stun and knocks back nearby enemies. Also has a passive that reduces the talisman's cooldown. That's the stuff of blocks and parries. That's awesome. I'm putting that on, even though that reduces my strength a lot. Unleashed powerful attack that inflicts stun damage and knocks back nearby enemies. Also has a passive that reduces the talisman's cooldown on successful blocks and parries. Nice, that's really good. Nice. Yeah, so it has like a crazy long cooldown, I imagine, because that's really good. Um... Nice, hook me up. Leviathan's Wake, Light Runic Attack, a powerful axe throw that plows through enemies in its path. I, uh, yes! Uh, yeah. We're definitely putting that over Hell's Touch. And we're gonna upgrade it too. Let's just have some fun. Nah! Meh? Yeah. Eh. It's 1500 to upgrade the thing. No, I'm not upgrading that. Uh, hold R1 to deliver a forceful haymaker. Oh, I love that. Let's do that. Um, I can do this one too. Continue pressing R1 to extend the length of punching after a fury strike. Sure, let's just do that. That sounds fine. Okay. Let's continue on. So now I'm even awesomer in my uh, Spartan Rage. Awesomer? More awesome? Ah, oh, fresh air feels good. Oh yeah, uh, this is not the way. And I think I did alright here. I think uh, there was one thing I have a question about over this way. Um, let's just go look real quick. There was that blue thing right there. What is that? Oh, it's one of the seals. I totally forgot. About the dude. Alright, so where's the third seal? I totally forgot about not the dude, but the chest. Um, that would have been just complete idiocy. Wow, I got really lucky there. Hell yeah. Man, I thought I was going to do, like, kill the Thor's, uh... Oh, that was cool. Kill the Thor statue, and instead I ended up doing, like, this crazy hidden area. Free the dragon. Got all kinds of... What happened to all the people who lived here? Follow the clues, boy. Right, right. Follow the clues. Yeah, we're... we're... So, there was an evil dwarf thing. And he made all these people hunt monsters. The people put them in cages, and then... And then I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'm missing a clue. Back inside the castle? No. 
There is nothing more for us inside. But stay alert for Chain Dragons, boy. Perhaps you'll uncover more about this Dwarf King. Yeah, maybe. Can I go up here? I feel like the only thing I got is this, this chain, but when I pull it, ah, dang. I got some more rage here, but I don't even need it. Alright, let's get up there. Very good. Ah, uh, great. It's one of these portal things. And I have no HP. Well, whatever. Let's try it. Oh, oh, nice. A formula substance found inside in Realm Tears used to enhance unique properties of various talismans. No shit. Okay. That one was just a freebie. Look at this guy. I think we have a complete set of those now. Okay. So yeah, I got the complete set of that thing so I can sell that. Get a ton of hack silver. And heck yeah, that's everything here. I'm convinced. I completely completed this entire island and crushed it into oblivion. Alright, this um, session is running a little long, but uh, I do want to do this one last thing before I call it an end to this part. Well, here it is. It's gotta have a weak point. Okay. Somewhere. Okay, let's... Oh, I don't like that. Nice. There's another bad guy around here somewhere. Oh, Jesus, get me out of here. Yes, sick! I forgot I changed it to that. Alright, did I cheese him? Yes, I did. You must learn efficiency, boy. Uh, do I care? No, I don't. But yeah, that was awesome. I totally forgot about my, uh, dude. That, uh, dude, where is it? How do I? Leviathan's Wake? Yeah, dude, I'm upgrading this. Yeah, that was sick. Alright, you're going down, Thor. Thor. 
Oh, there's another boat right here too. That's convenient. His father's grave. Find anything good? Perhaps. Father, we're going to bring down that statue, right? Legendary axe pommel. Low perk activation chance to strike and with an explosion of lightning. That inflicts shock damage to all nearby enemies and successful on any successful exit. Dude, I can't believe how many items I'm getting. This is like almost too many. So it just is a low perk activation. It's just a chance that that happens. All right, we'll keep that on because that seems good. Uh, let's see here. There he goes. What is he planning on doing this himself? Oh, there's a crow flying around this guy. Um. Uh, come on, crow. How did I not have him? Yeah, that was a sweet throw. Yeah, nice. Alright, let's see. Take him out here. About ready to topple over. Oh, there it is. Hey, Zach, he wasn't so Gods do not fall this easily, boy. I know, I know. I was just joking. Nor are they a joking matter. Sorry. Huh. All right. We did it. Why did the gods cause so much trouble for us? Because that is their nature. But with all that power, you would think at least some of them would try to make life better for people. And yet, the gods continue to spread misery. This is life, boy. Nope, there's another item over here. What's up, Brock? Let's get to it. Okay, I can't upgrade either of these things. This talisman. Oh my god. All it does is increase my defense by two. Then why would I ever upgrade that? Ever. Why would I ever do that? What the fuck ever? <laughs> That's hilarious. You there? Have you destroyed the statue? The statue stands no longer, spirit. Then my bond to this realm is severed. And I am off to find the real god of thunder. Do it. I'll meet you, you there. You will know retribution. My deepest gratitude. Off he goes. Brave guy. Going to look for Thor on his own. He is a fool. <laughs> yes, Where he did is. the spirit leave us? An offering to one of the gods. Can we use it? No. But perhaps the dwarves can. Nice. Uh, what did I get? Bring Tears Offering to Brock or Sindri? Okay. Let's do that real quick. See what he's got for us. Alright, Mr. Brock, I got something hey, for Brock. you. You found something interesting. Did you now? Well, color me interested. Tear would have been pleased as peaches knowing these offerings were being turned to armor. Did you know him? What was he like? Never you mind, boy. Tears did. Best not to dig up the past. The dwarf speaks wisely, for <laughs> once. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What's it gonna be this time? So I got new wrist armor here. Tears lost unity gauntlets. Offering to Tear, Agar's gold, Hacksilver. It's got an enchantment slot. Gets my defense up plus fifteen. My strength goes down by five. Who cares? Hell, yes. Let's do this. Gauntlets forged from an offering made by Tyr, blessed with Tyr's luck. 
Low perk activates a chance to grant a short boost to strength, defense, or runic when damage is taken. There's quality material. Rate you're going might last a day. Sprinting for three seconds grants unstoppable aura, preventing interruptions by enemy attacks. Okay, there it is. And it gives me cooldown, and it gives me strength. Heck yeah. That gives, increases just my vitality, okay. Okay, so it, the brilliant mark of the dragon was a freaking enchantment. I didn't even realize that. Good shit. Alright. Well, that's where I'm going to end it. Um, that was fantastic. I, I am just blown away. Uh, I got all this experience. I got all kinds of new stuff. I'm pretty sure I can go back and try and do those uh, black holes or whatever you want to call them. The special things where the guys were killing me. This armor is amazing. Um... Yeah, this is great. I'm so much stronger than I was. I just in, am in shock. I oh my! I don't even know where to begin when it comes to unlocking skills and magic and stuff like that. So, all right. Well, I'm going to head out of here for now. Thank you for uh, sticking around with me. Peace out. Good games. Have fun. Stay safe. Thank you very much.